this is what I think about Kodak Black and, and what he did, y'all. He sold his soul to the devil, and he for the, he's about to forever fight his career, trying to prove that he's not an Uncle Tom, that he's not a soul seller, that he's not a uh, do whatever it takes to get out to get out of trouble. He sold your soul. Then Donald Trump, the reason why you are out, knowing that you still finna go back to jail, facing 30 years for rape, you sold your soul to the devil. Now you got the Donald Trump stink on you the whole entire time you out. Why you out? And you excited and you happy. You really know deep down you got the Donald Trump stink on you. And then where you go, everything you do. That Donald Trump trail gonna follow you. It's like you out because of a criminal, of a crook. That only let you out to benefit him temporarily. Cause it's not gonna help him. And it's not gonna help you. You know what I'm saying? You're gonna, you're gonna suffer for this one, bro. Your whole career, your record sales, everything you do, features, new hits. Your song being played on the biggest advertising, you know, everything. You're going to suffer for this. Because you got that Donald Trump stink on you. And everybody know you you got, you got are out from a pardon from Donald Trump who can't be trusted. You know what I'm saying? You understand that? Dude's a joke. And you just made yourself a joke. Understand that. Everybody mark my word. Kodak Black career is about to show. Every song that is put out, it's not going to rock it like it used to. You're not going to get what you usually you used to get. And you're going to be looking around wondering why. Because you got that Donald Trump stink on you for accepting his pardon to get out. And you should have really just done your time. Especially for what you got going. You don't even need to really be out. You got some sexual activity assault shit going on. You can't dodge that, bro. You're going to suffer. Understand that. Big signs.